Hi and welcome to a new video. If you are bored with your iPhone standard alarm tones and you want to set your own song as an alarm clock, then stay tuned. I'll show you the quickest way to do this without a computer or jailbreak. Let's go. You need at least iOS version 13, otherwise the method in this video will unfortunately not work for you. You can find your iOS version under Settings, General and Software Update. Here you can also activate automatic updates if you want to. On top of that, you'll need the app GarageBand. This is an app from Apple that is already pre-installed on many devices, and if not, you can download it for free from the App Store. You can find the link in the video description below. Of course, you need a song in order to do that. The song might already be available in your Apple Music library. If so, then it's very easy for you and you can skip the next step. If you don't have a song yet, then download one online. I'll show you how this works in a sec. It is important to know that this does not work with songs from Apple Music, but it works with files that are stored locally on your iPhone. This is the case if you've put songs from your computer to your phone via iTunes. In order to download a song, open Safari and search for a song followed by MP3. Since I don't want to violate any copyrights, I'll search for no copyright sounds. Open one of the suggested websites, tap on the file and then on Download. At the top right, you can see that the file is currently being downloaded. Tap on it and then on the magnifying glass. You can go directly to the download folder in the Files app on your iPhone. Here, you can also listen to your song once again. A notification sound can only be 30 seconds long, so the song must first be cut to the right length. Tap on Continue and search for the audio recorder. In order to get to the timeline, tap on the three bars and then on the blue metronome icon to deactivate it. To add the song, tap on the looping icon in the upper right corner. If you have saved your song in the Music app, tap on Music, then on Songs, and now press and hold the song and drag it to the beginning of the timeline. If you downloaded the song, tap on Files, and then on Browse Items from the Files app. If you have just downloaded the song, you can find it in the Recents tab. Otherwise, go to Browse. There you can select the song as well. Then briefly tap on the song to import it, tap and hold and then drag it to the beginning of the timeline. Now tap on the small plus icon in the top right corner. Then tap on Section A and set 30 bars or seconds. If you want to cut out the beginning of a song, tap and hold the song, choose Trim and then you can try to cut out the beginning. Don't forget to move the audio track back to the beginning. You can listen to your excerpt by tapping on Play. To export the audio track, just tap on the small arrow in the upper left corner and choose My Songs. If you tap on the file, a menu opens where you can rename the song. Here you can also share the song as a ringtone. Export To set the alarm tone, open the clock, tap on Edit, select an alarm, and under Sound, you can select the ringtone you just created. That's it! If I could help you, feel free to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions. See you next time. Bye!